Frank Buckles, the last surviving American to serve in World War I, died this weekend. He was 110 years old. Buckles' biographer says he died Sunday of natural causes at his home in Charleston, West Virginia. More than 4.7 million people joined the U.S. military from 1917 to 1918. As of spring 2007, only three were still alive. We recognize a group of Americans who served in the Great War and lived to tell of it for the better part of a century. We honor these heroes and we want to hear their stories. By the time Buckles was honored at the Pentagon in 2008, the other remaining survivors had died. As the years went along and the decreasing numbers of the veterans, I found that I was among those who had served, the last ones who had served. And it, it is an honor to be here to represent the veterans of World War I. Buckles repeatedly tried to enlist in the military, but he was rejected because he was too young. In 1917, he finally convinced an Army recruiter that he was 18, though he was really only 16. Buckles never saw combat serving in England and France, mainly as a driver and a warehouse clerk. During World War II, he was a civilian prisoner of war in the Philippines. Buckles will be buried at Arlington National Cemetery. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.